everyone welcome back into another blur labs video i'm going to be helping you hopefully fix the problem that you come here for which is maybe just your fps is showing up the one thing like what it's running at but it's not showing up like the one percent lows the average the max fps also and you have them marked but it's just not showing up well this is going to be a super quick short tutorial on how to do that so let's jump right in and we're going to show you guys how to do that so first of all we're going to check this right quick we're going to pull up msi afterburner we're going to go right here to settings then we're going to go up here to monitoring you're going to click on that and then we're going to scroll down all the way to the bottom and as you see i have all this marked it's all marked right here minimal average maximum and one percent lows and yet as you see over here on the left it's not showing up maybe that's you but maybe you do not have all this set up yet so either way it's going to help both parties here and if you do have it set up hold on tight we're about to show you how to get that done so if you want let's just say the frame rate if you want it to show up these are the things that you're going to want to have check marked show in on screen display you want that on text or you can do text and graph i choose text but either one will work and then right here show in logitech keyboard lcd display and up here as you see on screen display osd and lcd is logitech keyboard display all four of them are marked and then down here on the override group name if you want this to show up on a separate line like right here below d3 d12 you want it on a new line which is what I do want all four of these I have overrided the name the group name and named them frame rate average and I put that in on the override group name for all the ones that I want on one line and every time you put that in it will add it to that line and then if you want a new line you can you know rename it and boom it'll even drop it down below that and so on and so forth we've got it all marked but yet it's still not showing up obviously so we're gonna click out of that go down here to show hidden icon and that's where your Riva tuner should be in your icon tray down here we're gonna bring that up and then you're gonna see this right here we're gonna come to the bottom down here to set up mine's blue yours should be blue but it you know could be something different but set up we're gonna come all the way down scroll all the way down and there should only be one box you might have others that's not check marked i can't remember exactly but the main one obviously that is not check marked right now that we need is enable benchmark mode as soon as we click that match ok boom just like i promised we're gonna click out of this we click out of this and here it is ladies and gentlemen we've got we have our minimal our average is in the middle our maximum and this is our 1% lows on the far right over here 28 FPS and now we have it and again because we named it all y'all can do it however you want to I wanted all four of these to be on the same line so I just went with frame rate average again this is like your minimal FPS that you're getting in the match your average what you're getting your maximum what you've gotten so far and then your 1% lows Guys, I hope that this helped you out. I hope it all made sense. If you want to see more tutorials like this, let me know as well. Hit that like button again if it helped you out. Subscribe if you're new to Blur Labs. Also, my other channel, Turbo Blur, is my gaming channel. Check it out as well. But I hope you all have a great day, and we'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace.